What's good, y'all? I have to send a, an important message to a YouTuber. This individual goes by Random Productions on YouTube. Now, we've been checking out their Try Not to Laughs, and they've actually been quite hilarious. So before I get into the seriousness of what's about to happen to them, I just want them to know your Try Not to Laughs are hilarious we appreciate you making those videos but there are some things me and dub we just don't appreciate now if you guys have seen a previous one from random productions that we checked out a while back he did an ai voice of dub essentially giving brock lesnar praise now we know dub would never give brock lesnar praise but the amount of praise this ai voice of dub was giving to brock it was sickening for dub very sickening he was that close to reporting random productions youtube page he was serious he was about to flag him he was gonna copyright him but he's like nah i'm gonna let him make it then recently we just dropped the video earlier today on the interclass page so if you want to check it out i will link it down below in the uh, comment section so y'all can go check it out it's a good try not to laugh video but he took it a step further he decided to make an ai voice of me he used my ai voice put in a program and he may you know use my likeness to essentially give ryback of all people praise What's good y'all it's your boy ross back at it again today i will be talking about a wrestler that's very near and dear to my heart he is my goat and i'm sure he's your goat as well ladies and gents i'm here to talk about ryback i will be listing my top four reasons why ryback is the goat of professional wrestling number one ryback is a man of few words even online where he communicates with a straightforward no nonsense approach he uses social media to connect with fans often delivering his messages with brevity and impact staying true to his direct and focused persona Number two, Ryback has cultivated a great online presence where he stands out for his positive approach and professionalism. Clippy! He rarely gets into any online conflicts, choosing instead to focus on uplifting and motivating his followers. This restraint oh. and focus make him a role model for other content creators like myself, showing that success online can be achieved through authenticity and positivity. <laughs> Number three, Ryback had a great WWE career. Never a mid carter always a main event contender. Whoa. His dominance and impact in the ring solidified oh, his place as a like top you. tier performer. And my fourth reason Ryback had a great WWE career, he was always performing in the main event level and never was a mid carter Just like legends in the wrestling business, Nia Jax and Sin Cara, the Ryback was known for being a safe and reliable in-ring worker with powerful performances while ensuring the safety of his opponents. This earned him respect from both fans and peers alike. And then he did the same thing in the video to Dub, back to back. And that's when I knew this man or woman must be stopped. So Random Productions, I just want you to know, I made this video and I'm dedicating this video to you because I want you to know your time has come. See, anytime anyone wants to make a joke on us, we're all for it. But when you keep making jokes and then you just keep going further and further now now we have to get our revenge and we need to make jokes about you crazy thing is this individual random productions they are in our discord let me pull up my twitter real quick for y'all man i'm gonna pull up my twitter real quick so y'all this tweet so I posted this to my Twitter. To the guy who made the AI version of me praising Ryback, he is in our Discord. Just know, buddy, your time is up. I will find out who you are. This is in our Discord right here. I screenshotted this. You know, shout out to everyone in the Discord. I even added him. I was like, hey, I got something for you, Random Productions. Just wait. You want to crash out? You got it. Random Productions, we are already on 
the road to finding who you are. We're not going to stop until we get you. See, someone else did this before. Recently, they were making some really good memes and we ended up finding who they were, where they're from, where they resided at. Even we found out, you know, you know, prior uh, cases they were dealing with, you know, got into some altercations, got the laws got involved. Now, we didn't obviously put that information out there because we're not going to do that. No, 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 no. We we don't condone that. We're not going to use your information. But it always is a little bit more satisfying to know. Oh, we know who you are. Granted, I don't need to know where you're from. But if I can get a picture, we can work with that. And we found out exactly who he was. And he was a good sport about it. He just was like, damn, y'all are really good. Yeah, we got a great team in the Discord. We're going to find you, Randall Productions. We're going to figure this out. And when we do figure this out, when we find out who you are, what you're all about, where you like to walk your dog at or cat at, or, you know, where you frequent your haircuts at if you do get one, maybe where you, you know, tend to go grocery shopping at. We're going to find out. We're going to find out. And when we do, your time is up. You see, I, I be trying to let y'all make it. But I won't stand for this. Me and Dub won't stand for this. Now, Dub, he may not have the time. He has a big family to deal with. He got a lot on his plate. But I got the time. I have the time to do this. So, Random Productions, I want you to know we are already in the works of finding out who you are. So, you can make this easier. You can make this easier. Just, you know, maybe in the next video, you can add me. On in the Discord privately, publicly, doesn't matter. You got me on Twitter, wherever. You can add me. You know. Show us who you are. Stop hiding. Show us who you are. You can do it. Make it easier for us. And then we'll have a fun at your expense. But I know you won't because that's not what you want. No, 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 no. I know you won't do it. So you know what? We'll do this the hard way. I will find out who you are, and we will still make fun of you at your expense. But that's all I wanted to do. I wanted to make this quick video, letting random productions know. I do appreciate your mean videos. Your try not to laugh videos are hilarious, but you've gone too far, and now you must pay. Okay? You must pay the ultimate price. We must find out who you are. So, hey. I asked some of y'all in the comments down below. If y'all have an indication of who Random Productions is, hey, go ahead and let me know. There may be some incentives for you. There may be some type of incentives for you. Now, once again, I'm not saying <laughs> let's put their personal information out there. No. No. Um, we we not we don't do that. But if you got a picture of random productions, you went to high school with them. Maybe went to college with him. Maybe went to middle school with him. Whatever. You know I'm at work. You have any indication? Hit me up on Instagram. DM me. Hit me up on Twitter. Whatever. DM me. We're going to find you. I got a team working on it. Your time has come, Random Productions. But all jokes aside, this was it, it was a funny video. Like I said, I'm going to link down the video down below in the comments. So that way y'all can go check them out. Uh, subscribe to his uh, YouTube channel. This is all jokes. A little bit. A little bit of it is jokes. We, we really are going to find you, though. But outside of that, it's all love, man. We're we not trying to send no harm or hate to the guy. It's all jokes. A little bit. We're going to fucking find you, you son of a bitch. All right, man. I'll catch y'all on the next one. Peace.